Okay, well there's something a little bit weird. I've just carefully been out to clean the shed out and not one hen came back to investigation. I'm telling you right now, every single time I clean the shed out, they are always in. They come in to see what I'm doing. I don't know, but this is the very first time ever that I have had no hens. So I've just popped in to get this camera to go and find out where they are. I haven't looked yet. I'm just being as quiet as I can. I'm just hoping they're just round the front. I've cleaned all the, cleaned it all out. We'll just pop in and have a look, check. Everything's been done. Jock's lost a feather this morning, noticed. So, we're just about to go and find out what's going on and where they are. Just let a car pass. Mm. Aha, there's one. Oh. Oh, thought I was going to catch you all doing something. Obviously not. Good morning. <laughs> you missed me cleaning out this morning. Who's missing? Two, four, six. One of the brown ones and one of the white ones. What's going on? Let's go and have a look. Perhaps a... Okay. There we go, Alice and Judy, is it? Not Alice, Maggie, even. I can't tell until I see your bottom. Yes, that's Judy. I've got nothing, darlings. Just come to see what you're all up to. Let's see what you... Mm, you've been digging again, I see. Good morning. I haven't got anything yet. I've just cleaned your shed out for you. Hello, Abigail. <laughs> Hello, Maggie. Oh, Felicity. Sorry, darling. Maggie, I can't believe how idiot I am when it comes to recognising these hens. Right, today I can see straight away that that's Mother, because she looks exactly like Abigail, but darker. This is Abigail. And then it's Pauline who looks nearly the same. And Connie. Connie and Pauline are very similar, but Pauline has a bit more of a baldy head than. I mean, Connie has a bit more of a baldy head than Pauline. This is Maggie, Scraggy Maggie. Where's Alice? Is this Alice? Yes, there's Alice. Is it? Yeah. Oh my goodness, I don't know. <laughs> yes, because there's Maggie, so that's definitely Alice with a little bit at the front. What are you doing again, pecking at my fingers? Do you like looking into the camera, Maggie? <laughs> oh. Ooh. My word. Doris, look at her bottom coming. Oh my gosh, Doris. Look at that fluffy bottom. Doris. Oh, you really, it's coming on now. Look at yours, Jodes. Jodes isn't bad either. Not quite as fluffy as Judy's, but you're doing right. I know I keep harping on about the fluffy bottoms, but... It's important to see their feathers all fluffy, especially after they've had nothing. Hello, Mother. See, so you've been... Oh, look, you took it all out again. I brushed all of that back into that back border. Brushed all of this up yesterday and made it all neat and <laughs> here they are again and it's all dotted with poo and this has all been dug up again. 
I don't know, you've been having a good time this morning. We've got a reasonably nice day. Yesterday turned horrendous after it started reasonably well. And we had rain for most of the afternoon. And I think we're going to have no rain today because there's a black cloud coming up there, look. Terry, what are you doing in there, matey? <laughs> look at him. What are you doing? <laughs> you silly boy. <laughs> oh, anything to avoid the hens. You don't like them, do you at all? <laughs> oh, dear God. You're getting stuck in that bush. <laughs> Gary, <laughs> when it's raining, if you can't get in at the back, he sits on this windowsill. Oh, where are you? I've got a cat bush. <laughs> Bees like this. Uh, Gary, here he is. Meow. You've lost the feather jock. That's not good, is it? I haven't done my sign yet. <coughs> ah, right, well, that was all I want you to do. Just check what you're all doing. I might see you all a bit later on. Might have a treat later, but at the moment I um, need to go in. I've got a couple of designs. I've had some orders through. And uh, I've got to draw the designs out. So I've got to do a bit of work this morning. I finished all my light boxes and they're all posted out. So. You're all going to come and follow me now, aren't you? <laughs> See, you don't have to have food to, to have your hands follow you. The anticipation of food is enough. <laughs> oh. Well, I don't know if it is, but they just follow me. Oh, yeah. Hey, well, your shed's all nice and clean for you, and you can go mess it all up again. <laughs> Nothing here for you girls. I need to clean this backyard up. It's a mess, this is. Absolutely rank. I don't know what I'm going to do with all this. Perhaps I need to put a few paving stones down. I don't know, but. It isn't pleasant, is it, girlies? Poo. I got rid of all the water out of there yesterday and it's all filled back up again. That's how much rain's been. Right, girls, I'm off in. See you later. Got a visitor in the house. I've decided I brought Felicity in. She's the one that roosts on her own on the ladder. So... And Abigail's having a having a mad <coughs> mad fit, aren't you? What are you doing? Me? <laughs> She's just had a tea. <laughs> No, don't you hurt Fliss. Leave Flitterty alone. You know Dave. Dave's being a bit strange today, aren't you, Dave? She won't come to me anymore. And the moment I put my hand close by, she... Oh, look at that. Look, she runs away from me. I'm not used to this. It's all used to her coming to me and she's just been a bit funny today. I don't know why. She, nothing's happened particularly that's scared her. I haven't done anything to her. Felicity's only just come in. This was this has happened with Dave long before Felicity come in. She's, Felicity has literally come in about 15 minutes ago. Dave's been a bit funny with me for the whole day since I woke up this morning. I don't know why. Dave! Dave! It's been very strange. 
Miss a tea. So I've just rubbed some more oil on the back and on the tips, well, on the joints of where wings like an el where her elbows, equivalent of her elbows or to her arms. <sighs> just washed her feet. She's got nice clean feet. Oh, Dave. Dave. What's the matter with you today? Why are you, why are you being funny with me? Dave, Dave, you went in, Dave. No, oh, Gary, come on, not you. I know what these two are waiting for. They want the, they usually have a sweetie after the dinner. Dave, Dave. Oh, don't you go in that dust bath now, or else you will make a mess. Just cleaned you. Oh, there's nothing in there for you to eat. It's soil. Bliss. Blissity. Don't sit on and eat stuff out of there. Don't eat stuff out of there, do we? Dave, Dave, come on, Dave, Dave, don't be silly. What's the matter with you? Why are you, why are you being funny with me? I'm very upset. Dave, it's not like you. You follow me everywhere, and now you're not. I'm hurt. What is the matter with this little girl? <coughs> what? Sweeties, hey, are you? <laughs> Dave's looking for his food, her food, I should say, and, and it's over here. Flister's been eating it. Hi, Dave. Come on, then. Dave, look, she's running away from me. She just won't have me today. I don't understand it. She was snuggled on me last night, and now she's just not interested today. I'm just, I just don't know what to think. Dave, come on then, look, she isn't, no, not having me. This is very upsetting. Dave, Dave, come on then, come on Dave. Dave, Dave. Oh, I don't know, oh well. Felicity up on the back of the city with some towels behind her so we don't have to deal with oh we're watching Kyle the Rooster Mum posted it looks so strange having the having everything outside like that <laughs> outside of the pen <laughs> I don't like it when he leaves the camera and he's not there. I like hearing his voice because he's funny. Ah, that looked like to me that he shoot her there then. Well, yes, you off. did. Right, you in. did. <laughs> Back to Felicity. <laughs> She's staying in for a bit, aren't you, darling? So we've got a towel behind her to catch any undesirables. That's where. Um, you. You're listening to Kyla Rooster. You hear the ducks and the geese. <laughs> oh, Dave. 
Why are you being funny with me, Dave? I'm really upset. <laughs> I need to get some more soil for you. Be gone soon. I did Flusty getting in there earlier. She would have made a right mess, but I didn't really want her in there because she just had oil put on her. Oh, Dave. Oh, this has settled nicely. She hasn't at all been upset that she's in the house. She's quite enjoyed it, haven't you? You like being here. It's nice and warm. Something different to do instead of sitting in there with them miserable girls. I don't know why you have to sit on that ladder all by yourself. I feel sorry for you. Well, we'll get those feathers back and you'll look nice. We, we will. <laughs>